What's up fam and happy 2023. We are already a few days into the new year yes. and Jamil and I decided that we really had a craving for pizza today. As you can see. Uh, so I went to Metro Pizza and got a pizza with pepperoni, meatballs, garlic, and mushrooms. Yes. <laughs> Looks incredible. And then we're going to be talking about our New Year's resolutions mm -hmm. with you guys, which we're really excited about. I think it's important to um, you know, pay attention to like what you want for the year and uh, goals that you want to achieve and, you know, just some mindfulness. I think that's really important. So true. we're going to chat about our what we are uh, wanting for our New Year's resolutions this year. Exactly. Kristen doesn't know mine. I know. And, and, and I don't know yours. Jamil wants to keep so, his a secret. I've been like, babe, yeah. like, and we're <laughs> Mary. Like, just tell me what your New Year's resolutions are. He's like, no, nope. I have to wait for the video. I gotta tell the fam first. So, that's what we're doing. <laughs> so, let's have some lunch, shall okay. we? Okay, yeah, you guys. So, Metro Pizza's been around since uh, 1980. Um, I, I'm not sure the, I'm not sure if exactly if they started in Las Vegas, but you know, they've been I think they did. Oh, no, they I did. think they did. Yeah. They've okay. been around for a long time. Okay. Um, but I was going to say, uh, the girl in there, which by the way, I didn't get her name, but shout out to her. She was really awesome. Uh, she was just talking about how amazing the pizza was. And, you know, she was saying that, like, she goes to other pizza places. Here, I'll lower it a little bit. No, the issue is it's that we should have had it. It's, that it's floppy, which is fine. It's just we should have. Yes. Uh, Do you want a napkin? No, I'm good. We just should have plates. Okay. But well, it's cool. I'll just eat mine over this. We're just going to, yeah, <laughs> yeah, you should, can you? Can you? Uh, oh, I okay. will. Sorry to interrupt you. I know you're telling the story. No, it's okay. It's okay. okay. I was just going to say that. Um, okay, you're just going for it. Just go. Chris is going for it today. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. This is really good. It really is good pizza. Oh, wow. Mm. Um, the girl was saying that mm -mm -mm. she was saying that this pizza, which I, I, I kind of agree with her, is better than a lot of other pizza places. She'll go every... She said um, mm -hmm. for the holidays, she was out of town, ate at a couple of pizza places, mm -hmm. and she was like, they were good, but she was like, I can't wait to get back to work and really get back to this pizza. She's a which, very good promoter. She is. She is. Now, I don't know if she was maybe the daughter of the owners or maybe the owner herself. Go ahead and throw some on. Not sure. Maybe she's just a, a dedicated I think she's worker. A fan. Yeah. I think she's a dedicated <laughs> worker. And you know what? Honestly, this pizza is good. So I actually can understand that. Mmm. 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 I'm glad we got this. Mmm. -hmm. Mmm. Meatballs are great. Mm. Sometimes. Meatballs are a little too overpowering for me. At least the size wise, they put like too much on there. Uh -huh. But here it's good. They slice them. So you can see they're kind of like, they're more sliced rather than just like a big chunk. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? I hate that. Man, I'm so happy right now. <laughs> I am. Um, we really needed pizza. We needed a good pizza. So mm -hmm. that's what we did. So mm -hmm. it's a great way to kind of start this new year Yeah. off with a bang and good food. Would you say this is one of the better pizzas that we've had so far out here? Yeah, this one's really good. This one's a really Metro good. Metro Pizza. There's a few locations in Las Vegas, so we yeah, I definitely recommend it. Mm-hmm. I have some ranch dressing. Oh, thank you. Mm -mm -mm -mm. We actually haven't gone to a lot of pizza places out here. What have we done? Maybe like three or four. Oh. Mm, we've done, done a like lot. Six or seven. No. Yeah. <laughs> we've done a lot. We've done Giordano's. Amano's. Mm -hmm. Um, what's the fat babies? Yeah, we've done a lot, babe. Wait, Grim I gotta count them really quick. Grimaldi's. Grimaldi's. Uh, Twisted Pizza. Shout out to Twisted Pizza, by the way. They were really good. Twisted Pizza. Yeah, we've done a ton. Um, uh, we to call. Then Pizza Rock. Or Pizza Rock. That's right. Windy City Pizza. Yeah. Evil Pizza. Mm -hmm. Okay, we've been to a lot. <laughs> we have. It doesn't feel like that, though, no. does it? Mm -hmm. That's so crazy. Right. Mm hmm. Mm. Uh oh, you spilled. Did I? Mm hmm. Did I? A little bit. Oh, you just spilled crumbs. Oh, okay. I'm like, did I? Okay. Mm -hmm. You're good. <laughs> I'm just dri dripping off the grease so it doesn't spill on my shirt, but mm -hmm. this ranch is hella good. Okay. Can I tell you really quick? Yeah. About a TikTok I listened to. Yeah. This guy was talking about New Year's resolutions, and I could not agree with him more. Mm hmm. Um, he was talking about how when it comes to resolutions, you know, so many people put so much expectations on them, but at the end of the day, you know, breaking a habit is more than just saying you want to do something in the next day, just doing it. A lot of times yeah. for most people, you can't just break a habit like that, mm -mm. depending on the habit, of course. 
habits stick really, really hard. It's the reason why, you know, most people, when they have resolutions, you know, by two months in, they're gone. <laughs> you know, they haven't There's changed a thing, you know? Mm -hmm. So it's really kind of crazy did the way that advice? works. Um, he did. I think I changed the video by then. <laughs> or is that what I was scrolling just through. Or did the guy just basically say, you're going to set resolutions and there's no way you're going to make them? <laughs> Literally, as soon as he, yeah. He so probably had a boy. It, I was like, I agree. Swipe up. <laughs> and then <laughs> went to the next video. That was like probably a completely pointless video. You know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but it's a true statement, though. Mm -hmm. But not us. Well, we got breakable habits. We did. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think that does go to show that. Mm -hmm. um, yes, for New New Year's resolutions, you're right, because a lot of people do break them, right? Mm -hmm. So you really do have we to... We have plenty of times. Oh, yeah, of course. Plenty of times. I think you probably break more than you follow, uh -huh. you know? Mm -hmm. So I do think it is really important that every day to be mindful of them and take little steps towards them, whatever that is, though, right? Yeah. You can have big resolutions or small ones, right? Things mm -hmm. that are multiple step resolutions versus a single step resolution, right? So... Mm -hmm. Depending on what it is, you know. Do that. You want to put that down? I feel bad that you're holding. No, no, it's all good. <laughs> I wanted to flip it on him. Okay. Had to flip it on y'all, mm -hmm. um, but the problem is, you can't really see it so much anymore. Oh, there you go. Mm. There it is. This ranch is really good. Mm-hmm. So, okay. Oh, but, I'm dying to hear your resolutions, babe. You ready to hear mine? I want you to start. We can go back and forth. Mm. Okay. So, you guys, my New Year's resolution. My New Year's resolution is to... How many do you have? I have three. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Three solid ones. I got like 50 other ones. So. <laughs> okay. But I got three solid ones mm -hmm. that I'm working with. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. It's to get a new wife. A new... No, I'm joking. <laughs> I'm just teasing. Listen, you can get that. <laughs> I can leave anytime. Okay. Listen, habits are hard to break, but I can break them. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Uh, honestly, so what, my first one, you guys, I want to actually, as a lot of you guys probably know, um, you know, I do, before we started doing these mukbangs, I actually was doing music and I haven't put out a new, I haven't put out an album in like, I want to say like seven years, wow, so and, which is crazy one. because you guys, I had been doing it since high school um, and I haven't put out a song though. Or recorded a song in like four years wow. which is crazy you guys i was doing songs all the time it's all i did so i'm gonna actually put out a new album this year that's yeah. my goal you've never went that long ever. no You're I've, right. ne I've never gone that long mm -hmm. um it this is definitely an attainable goal um i did have this goal two years ago i think and i just i just wasn't able to keep it but this is a little different this time. My passion for doing music actually has come back a lot more. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Mm -hmm. So, so you guys, I'm going to put out, uh, I think that's the plan is to not just record the songs, but to actually put it out this year. It's probably going to be towards the end of the year. Oh, and I should say this. It's going to be an EP, which is like a shorter album. So it's going to be like, you know, anywhere from four to six songs. Like, obviously doing a full, like, 12, 13, 14 songs. That's a lot. <laughs> so I'm just going to put out a few. I'm just going to put out a few. I'm so excited for you. Thank you. And some music. I think that's great. I appreciate that. Yes, I know you've been wanting to do it for a little while now. Mm -hmm. um, and you are so talented. Like, you know, you have to keep with that passion because mm -hmm. you're so good at it. Thank you. Well, mm. I'll be keeping you guys informed for sure about it. Mm -hmm. um, Kristen will be hearing it every day. <laughs> I'm sure. <laughs> I'm excited. Yeah, I appreciate yeah. that. I mean, and, sorry. And you've been encouraging me to do it for a long time. I have. I've been, been like, nah, no, nah, not really. But mm -hmm. I feel like now's the time. Mm -hmm. Now's the time. I've had some labels reach out to me from um, overseas and stuff like mm -hmm. that from my older songs. And I'm just like, I need to put out some new stuff, you know? Mm -hmm. So that's the plan. I love that's it. That's the plan. I love it. I do have to say, because mm -hmm. sometimes you can have a passion, or not a passion, sorry. Sometimes you can have a talent mm -hmm. and not have it be a passion. And, yeah. just, and, and that's okay, you know? So mm -hmm. I would never want anybody to feel forced to do something just because sure. you're good at it. Mm -hmm. But I do think you do have it as a passion. Um, we just, you just took a break for different reasons, you know? Yeah. I mean, there were definitely a lot of reasons why I took a break. But for the most part, yeah. honestly, it's like... I, I, every time, like, you guys, I had to, like, stop listening to music. I mean, this wasn't the only reason why I stopped listening to music, but I don't know if I've really talked to you about this. Like, I'll intentionally not listen to music because every time I listen to it, 
I started getting excited. I'm like, I got to do a new album. Got to want to do a new album or do some new music. And then, but I, but a lot of times I couldn't do it because we're doing our channel. We have other things that we've been focused on. So because of that, I've been like, all right, let me stay away from music oh, so I don't get that excited. No. Even though like, don't get me wrong. It's not like I'm intentionally like, oh, I can't listen to music so I don't work on music mm -hmm. or so I don't want to make music. Mm -hmm. It's just more of if I'm doing this, I want to, doing the mukbangs and stuff, I want to stay focused watching things that are going to motivate me to do mukbangs and motivate me to want to do that. Does that make sense? Yeah, our Yeah, channel. so exactly, our channel and stuff like I that. I got it. So anyways. But now it's time to listen to music. Now it's time to listen to music. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's good. Exactly. Um, okay. Do you want to go next or should I go? I'll go one. Okay, I'll do cool. one. Okay. Are you sure you're okay holding the pizza? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Got this covered. Okay. It's doing really good. Okay. Um, let me think. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. So, one mm -hmm. of my news resolutions, as you guys know, oh. excuse me, we have been, um, you know, on a health journey as we eat pizza. You guys are, some of you are mad about it. I get it. You guys, this is healthy pizza. I get it. Okay. <laughs> Very healthy. <laughs> some of you are mad about it. I get it. It's but not. you know what? It is what it is, right? Mm -hmm. We're on a health journey. Um, we have been doing things, uh, fasting. Can I get that ranch, by the way? I'm sorry. Yeah, you can. I'm going to put it right here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We've you. been doing intermittent fasting mm -hmm. and it's going really, really well. Anyways, so mm -hmm. um, we are down a lot of pounds. Yep. Um, I guess as of this morning. Yeah. What am I down? 40. I'm like 47 pounds down. I'd gained a little bit when we went to um, California. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But all the way, let it get in California, which wasn't a lot. It's back down to where I was before I left. So that's great. Mm -hmm. Anyways, point being, I would like to lose 50 at least 50 more pounds this year. Yeah. And I know I'm going to do it. Like, I know I am. And I feel mm -hmm. super good about that. And it's not just the weight goal of of health, because uh, mm -hmm. that is part of it. But mm -hmm. in terms of, like, a lab work, mm -hmm. I want all of my numbers mm -hmm. to be, like, completely, completely great. You're saying, just to be clear, you're saying it's health all around. Yes. But you're saying it's not just weight, it's mm -hmm. also the blood work. Yes, Because you work. said it's not just health, it's blood work. Sorry, I'm just... It's mind. not just weight. Sorry, yes. you're right. Yes, it's not just weight. Yes. It's make sure you're, yeah, you're healthy on the inside as well. That's yes. good. That's a good goal. Yes. That's a good goal. It is. And I want you guys to yeah. know, and I know you guys, again, a lot of you who love us and you've been with us forever, you support us and you understand. So mm -hmm. I totally get it. Those of you who don't, you're like, you're eating pizza. How are you going to be healthy eating pizza? And and surprisingly, you can. You know, you can. We, we do a good balance. It's all you about know? the time, you guys. It's all, <laughs> with all our, about the time. With our intermittent <laughs> fasting, it is all about the time we eat. Yes. Exactly. And mm -hmm. then, yes, off camera, doing other things. Yeah. We, yeah. Of course. A lot of you don't, you know, might not believe it, but we do go to the gym almost every day, which is mm -hmm. awesome. Mm -hmm. And uh, we feel really good. You know, we do some weights, we do some cardio. Mm -hmm. And yeah, so anyways, do lots of stuff. So it's going to be, yeah, weight loss. Okay. And then just lab work. I want to be immaculate. So not even like... Um, I would love to be, obviously, yes, the, all of the normal levels will be perfect, mm -hmm. um, which I don't think is going to be hard to do, but I want to even be, like, low normal, if that makes mm -hmm. sense. Like, mm -hmm. not even close to, like, a borderline high. Anymore. Yes. Yeah. I yeah. feel you. Yeah. I like that. I think that's a good goal. I think 50 pounds is a reasonable goal. That's, you know, so it's definitely, I definitely think it's something that is going to take, I mean, who knows? It could be half of the year or something like that. But mm -hmm. it's I feel like it's a healthy number, right? Because what does a doctor say? Like, make sure you're not losing more than, like, a pound a week or something or like that, like, right? Yeah, or... two pounds a week. Mm -hmm. One to two pounds, right? So let's mm -hmm. just call it two pounds. Mm -hmm. Two, four, six. That's eight pounds a month. Mm -hmm. Eight times 12 yes. is... is it... I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what am I, middle school? No, eight... <laughs> I don't know math anymore. <laughs> I don't know. What is eight times 12? I don't know. I'm like... 12, oh, 24, 70, 36, 48, 60, 72, 96. Oh, that yeah. <laughs> so if you lose eight pounds a week, 12 weeks, 96. So, and I'm actually, I would like to lose more than 50, but I think 50 is like a reasonable. Yeah, I think that's a Wait, reasonable number. Did I number. do the math right? I have no idea. 12, 24, 36, 48, 60, 72, 84, 96. Yeah, that's awesome. Sounds right to me. Yeah, so. Good job. So 50 is definitely healthy. I failed my 12s math test. <laughs> I really did. I got 11s, I had. <laughs> when I got to 12, I did not do well. <laughs> I can do about the 72 and that's it. <laughs> but what if you do it by the 8s? And just do 8 times, you know, 8, 16, 24, 32, 40, 48, 86. You know, well, 8 times. 64, 72, 80. Well, I did well on 8s. Then go do 8s. 8 times 12. 
I don't know what it is though. That's the <laughs> problem. <laughs> but you said you did well in eighth. Well, yeah. Oh, but I see I what did, you're saying. Yes, anything twelve, I stopped learning. I see what you're saying. <laughs> yes. Like a small number times twelve. Yes. You didn't know. Can I be honest? Shout out to my mom. She bought me, which helped me a lot. Yeah. Uh, a multiplication, multiplication rap tape. <laughs> Back in elementary school, and it was the worst rap ever, but I listened to it, mm -hmm. and it helped. Didn't help that much. But I much. never, I know, right? Well, it's actually my fault, uh -huh. because I never made it to 12. I never listened to 12. Uh -huh. It was so bad, I was like, I can't do 12. <laughs> I can't. I'm serious. And I, I did well on all the other ones, but 12 was bad. Oh, okay. Because each song was different, and 12 was just horrible, terrible. Don't make Jamil do any multiplication <laughs> times 12. He exactly. Except times one or zero, I can do those. <laughs> Jamil, Jamil stops at 11. <laughs> oh, I love it. Okay, so yes, one of my goals, weight mm -hmm. loss, and just like health with blood work as well, because as we know, you can lose weight and not be healthy internally as well, so. Cool. Okay. That's great. Yeah. Should I go next? Yes. Okay. My next resolution, guys, is to stop eating pizza. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just joking. Listen. I'm going to keep eating. Jamel <laughs> loves pizza. I, yes. It's not happening. Mm. But but anyways, no, all honesty, um, I think it's going to be... <sighs> okay. I feel like I'm embarrassed talking about this kind of... No, I'm not really that embarrassed. Don't be embarrassed. But, you guys, over the years, my memory recall has gotten terrible. Terrible. Like, I can't recall, like, so much stuff. So, mm. and, and I... I think I've kind of figured out exactly what it is. It's kind of the way that I'm like processing my, processing my thoughts and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And uh, I get, you know what it is too? Getting on the phones, mm -hmm. I'm constantly like distracted, like, mm -hmm. you know, like looking at new things. You know how like the phone really kind of messes up your attention span and stuff like that. Totally. So when I'm like processing my thoughts, I process it in a way where I'm thinking of multiple different things at the same time. Sure. And I really need to focus on like one thing at a time. Mm -hmm. So I'm really going to do a lot of meditation and I have to focus on building my recall. And not just the recall, it's actually also just like speech and like all sorts of different things. Like Great I goal. really need to work on that. Great really goal. need to work on that. Like I've never, I haven't worked on it. I might have worked on it one year a long time ago and it did help. Mm -hmm. But honestly, I need to work on it more. Yeah. I do. I really do. Okay. Yes. That's a great goal. I need to work on that. It's bad. Okay. Recalls memory, just in case, in case people don't know. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, I was going to say, I actually uh, would, that's a great goal. Yeah. I agree with you. Um, in terms, yeah. My memory is okay. My speech is not good. I can't think mm -hmm. of certain words yeah. to say. I've noticed that. Mm -hmm. um, and I, who knows what that's about. But yeah. yes, I feel like I can't come up with the right word all the time. Well, there's a lot of reasons for it. I think, you know, I think I, I did a little bit of research on it, obviously. It has to do with you know, of course getting older right <laughs> it's kind of a normal thing as you get older but also it's you know it's a lot of it's a lot of other things too right when it comes to health or uh but it also honestly these phones really jack things up i think so too like they really do they really do so mm -hmm. and then of course you have anxiety and all sorts of things mm -hmm. that really do kind of mess things up mm -hmm. there you know what i mean facts so recall that's a big one for me it's a good one it's a yeah. great one i support you with that thank you i love it i know you can do it yes speaking of anxiety that you just said yes that's my new uh, <laughs> new year's resolution number two mm -hmm. i've talked about this in a few videos um yep. Yes, I definitely uh, have anxiety. It's something that I've uh, struggled with for many, many, many years mm -hmm. since I was um, probably a teenager. Yeah. So anyways, um, and I think, yes, so I just wanted to say that too, uh, mm -hmm. for those of you who don't know, because we all have something, you know, um, mm -hmm. and we all struggle with whatever it is in life. Yep. And that's okay. There's nothing to be ashamed of, especially True if it that. is a mental health disorder. It's yeah. really important that we take care of ourselves and we, and we check ourselves and we use coping skills and we make sure that we are as healthy and functioning as possible true that um you know uh like despite it. you know what we have so we have to work on that right so anyways um uh with in terms of anxiety i really want to do things that are triggering that are anxiety provoking for me mm -hmm. um because i think it's really important to not you know avoid things that are um were wor worrisome or, or anxiety provoking yeah. because sometimes if you avoid then you can you continue to avoid and then you and then you True. continue to avoid more and more and more and more and sometimes your window of experiences can get really really small because you're so afraid yeah um so i don't want that to happen to me so mm -hmm. i want to start doing things that are nerve-wracking that are triggering yep. um so i can like work through them and like know that i can handle it you know yeah. so in addition to that i want to um also just like work on i said this last year and i didn't do it mm -hmm. nearly as much as i wanted to 
you guys. I need to meditate. I oh. really want to meditate. <laughs> <laughs> what were you going to say? <laughs> I, I was going to say, Kristen's failing from last year. No, oh, I'm, yeah. I'm just, I'm just teasing. I'm teasing. I just really want to meditate a lot more. Yeah. I guess I should put a number on it. I can come up with that later. Like, yeah. how often I want to do it. How many minutes a day? Five minutes a day. Start there. Thanks. Okay, do whatever. <laughs> yeah, sorry. This is yours. This is your resolution. Yes. I'll let you keep going. No, but it's that. a good start. Yeah. Um, so anyways, yeah, because I just, I so in addition to, yeah, anxiety, mm -hmm. really just like working on triggers and like kind of getting through them, you know, things like that. Yeah. I just think that can give me like, you know, really, it's really good for you. Yeah. So I want to do that. But then also with the meditation, I think it's really about like, who am I? I think we're always trying to figure out like, what type of person am I? Who do I want to be? How do I want to be in the world? How do I want to present myself to other people mm -hmm. in my personal life, family, friends, acquaintances, our K and J fam? You know, how do I want to be? You know, how do I want people to feel after they interact with me? Yes. Really thought about that. Yeah. Um, and so um, I, I want people overall mm -hmm. to have a really good experience just with me. I know they can't, it probably isn't going to be 24 7. You know, yeah, I'm a human, okay. but I want people to have a good experience with me and feel good after interacting with me. Like that makes me feel good. So. I'm, I'm I'm pretty sure people have a good experience with Thank you. <laughs> I mean, I'm 24 7, I'm sure. But yeah, no, I get it. I hear you. I try though. to be a good person, you know. You are, yeah, okay. absolutely. But I, I know Thanks. what you mean. Like, yeah. you, we always want to develop ourselves. Yeah. I mean, yeah. you know, there is no person out in this world that doesn't have something that they need to work on, you know, or yes. want to work on. Right. So that's something that, you know, that makes sense. Something and I, new, you thank like you. Anything. And I, you know what? I think it is a good goal to, like, try to mm -hmm. be as like I want people to feel good after interacting with me I think that's yeah. a cool goal to have you know like it I is. was thinking about that I'm like you know some people probably don't you know maybe you know oftentimes our goals may, might yeah. be about ourselves mm -hmm. and they are like I feel good that people are gonna feel good talking to me yes. but I really want other people to feel good I want people to feel important I want yeah. people to feel special because you are you know mm -hmm. we all are and sometimes we really forget that mm -hmm. so True. if I can do just little things to make people feel good and important and happy like that's what it's about you know it's true it really it really is so that's a good perspective yeah thank that's you i really yeah. want to do that yeah. i think it's it's important to reflect on these types of things and want to adjust you know accordingly like mm -hmm. you want i mean i feel like we could always use more love in the world right mm -hmm. i feel like people always throw the word love around and stuff like that but how much do they really love? <laughs> no, I'm just joking. But it's true. I mean, people yeah. do love, but it's like, it's That's good to be able love. to show it to other people and yeah. show appreciation and gratefulness and all those type of things, you know? Love it. Right? So anxiety, that's something you feel like you want to work yep. on if you meditation. Anxiety by increasing, yeah, by doing triggers for me yeah. and like enduring them. And then I'm meditating more. Looks like we're both going to be meditating. <laughs> okay, that's it for my resolutions, but I know you had one more. So. I got one more. Okay, yeah. Go for and it. I have to say this. Mom, if you're watching, and I'm sure she is, I love you very, very much. Yes. I'm going to be calling you more this year. Yes. That is my New Year's resolution. That's one of two other ones. Actually, to be honest, it might be like five or six. Because ultimately, it's not just calling my mom, it's calling all my family. Oh, okay, yes. I need to call my family so much more, you guys. It's really bad. It's actually not even, it's beyond It's bad. not funny. It's it's not funny even though I'm laughing, but that's what, that's what I do. I don't want you, no, no, no. I'm not, it's bad. Okay. I'm not saying it like that. I'm just saying it is, it's it's so bad it's not funny. Oh, but yeah, that's what it is. I'm not saying it. It. It's not funny, Jamal. You're no, making a joke. Yeah. <laughs> I'm realize. just saying, um, yes. Pam, please help, please just remind Jamal. I think that's actually a really good thing. <laughs> remind Jamal to call his family. Like, and it's not like he doesn't talk to them. I want no, the I fam to, to know. Them. You do talk to them, but yes. you want to talk to them more. A lot Listen, more. I don't need any reminders, you okay. guys. <laughs> I, don't, <laughs> I don't need you guys blowing up my comment section. Okay. If, you, if you want, feel free. But honestly, it's a personal thing. I just need to work on more. Yeah. Um, you know, I, I feel like over the years, one of the biggest things has been I get so preoccupied on uh, other things, whether it was my music or channel or mm -hmm. just other things, helping other people, doing things. And I, I really have kind of fallen off like connecting with family and stuff like that mm -hmm. and you know I, you know a big part of it too is like you know a lot of my family and when I'm talking to them we do spend a large amount of time on the phone which I do appreciate when I'm actually talking to them but a lot of times in my mind I'm like well I don't have the time to talk so then I just keep pushing it out more and more and more mm -hmm. and the next thing you know you know like I said for my mom it's like you know, sometimes it's like a month sometimes it's like two months you know so I, I have to do a better job and I will do a better job this is the year for that. I'm going to say that for me, to be honest, you guys, it's probably going to be the hardest resolution for me. Mm -hmm. That's going to be the hardest thing because I really do struggle with it. Like, I've actually been trying to contact family a lot more. 
um, over the years. I've told myself to, but I just I just haven't really felt fallen through. Or, sorry, I haven't really gone through with it. But this year, this is the year. I have really good strategies for you. Oh, do you? Yes. Listen, is this your resolution or mine? It's no, yours. It's but if you want okay, strategies, like I would love to hear it. Really? Okay, here we go. Because I, I know you mentioned like sometimes you feel like you have to talk a long time. Yes. Okay, so you're going to cut that out. This is what you're going to okay, do. Yes. When you're like running errands and you're in the drive yeah. mode, so it takes 15, 20 minutes to drive places. Yes. Make the phone calls and they and cut them short. But if you okay. have them more frequently, it's fine. You know, I think that that is the big deal to think that you need to allot an hour and a half to two hours to talk. Okay. That's not true. You don't have to. So when you were running errands, call people. This is a good point. Yeah. I, I actually will try that. Good. I can't promise that that will work though. And here's why, because driving is actually one, in my mind, it's like one of the best times to like put headphones on and just vibe out listening to like a podcast or some sort of YouTube video or something like that. Mm -hmm. I'm serious. I mean, you're not usually in the car. If I, obviously, if I'm by myself, you're not in the car with me. Yeah. But I'm like zoning out listening to stuff. Yeah. I mean, you know, you've called me and I'm like, hey, I got to call you back because I'm listening to something right now. Do you I say it all the want time. to get this resolution no. or not? <laughs> of course I do. <laughs> but what I'm trying to tell you is you that it's actually, that's actually a great idea, but it is one of the hardest ones for me. Yeah. It's actually not like a simple Because you're thing not doing do. nothing normally. Yeah, because I'm usually <laughs> listening and it's my time to like vibe and, you know, mm -hmm. really listen to stuff because... I don't know. I like I like driving and listening to stuff. However, I can't talk. Though. No, if you want to keep the vibe with the drive, uh, that's fine. Then listen, you'll have to a lot of time. Listen, this is my resolution. Yeah. And you're going to take whatever excuse I'm going to give. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just joking. I just want you I to. Know. I appreciate it. It is hard to find time in the world. Yes. So I thought that. But you're right. If you want to keep it to podcasts, that's cool. It's easy to find time. The reality is we occupy it with a lot of things. I just got to take some of those things away. Exactly. Those podcasts, those YouTube videos. <laughs> <laughs> you know all that stuff yeah. and start to put the new stuff in you can do it i'm really proud of you, you. i will remind you if you want reminders as well yeah do you have another uh suggestion no i'm not gonna give you any suggestions uh, why not you I just gave me one that good. was good awesome let's hear one more i don't know i don't have one right now but oh, i will try to listen. but i do i don't have one right now I promise. Okay, but i will cool. support you no worries. and i want you to do that i think that's awesome and i do Thank think you. the fam once in a while you can't remind them Listen, you guys. Just remind No reminders. Friendly so. reminders. <laughs> Nothing's wrong with that. But those are really good resolutions. Thank you. Do yes. you have any more or was that the three? That's it. Okay. I had four actually. Oh. One of them was to stop eating pizza. Okay. Guess what? <laughs> I stopped. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll see we'll see what happens the next time I have pizza though. <laughs> that was really delicious. Very yummy. So So you guys, thank you so much for watching. Um let us know what your resolutions are. Feel free to comment below. We'll definitely check them out. Mm -hmm. Um it's yeah. always awesome to be able to share those resolutions. Sometimes yes. it helps. It makes them real, right? Yes. It makes them physical to actually type them out or write them out and stuff like that. Yes. So, Feel free to comment below. Let us know. Yes. Putting them out into the universe is really important. So sure. let us know your resolutions. If you want to share with us, we'd love to hear them. Exactly. Okay, you guys. We love you so much. And thank you for watching. And we'll yes. see you guys next time for another video. Peace. Happy 2023. Yes. Mm -hmm. I should be doing this. Ah, yeah. Peace out, trouts. Two, three. Peace. There you go. Peace <laughs> out, trouts.